How many egrets is a lot? Is it one, two, five, or twenty egrets? Or maybe this many? Hello, my dear friends. I can remember getting very excited when I saw my first little egrets in the UK, followed a few years later by my first great egret. But here in some fish ponds on the edge of Bangkok, I'm going to show you a phenomenon that will put egrets in a whole different light. Massive congregations of egrets like this are not an uncommon sight in Thailand, where rice fields are being flooded or, as in this case, a fish pond has been drained. When the fish pond is fully stocked, the water is deep. But when it is drained so that the fish can be caught, plenty of small fish are left in the puddles and channels. And the egrets take advantage. This impressive flock consists of great egret, little egret, and smaller numbers of Javan pond heron. Javan pond heron is the smallest and most colourful of these, looking smart in breeding condition. While little egret and great egret have completely white plumage. Large groups of egrets like this have few, if any, natural predators in Thailand. However, large water monitors sometimes try their luck. Some studies have shown that group fishing like this increases an individual egret's catch, presumably as it is centred around a superabundance of food. It could also be that large numbers of birds force fish into behaviour that makes them easier to catch. The best way to get close to these egrets without disturbing the whole lot is to use the car as a hide. And sitting here like this, I can see that such is the super abundance of food that an egret catches a fish every couple of seconds. Fish form a large part of the egret's diet, but they also feed on frogs, reptiles and small mammals. If you enjoyed this video, check out what's on the menu for a great egret in this video next.